Shimano Zodius. Um, this is my 6.4 ultralight solid tip. So right here, the solid tip is gonna, um, it's like it's a little softer tip, it's a solid tip. Then right here is gonna be a tubular, tubular little blank that goes through. So it gives it a little, little softer action over here on the wiggle, on the wiggle part. But yeah, I love this rod. It's a very sensitive rod, has a monocoque handle, has EVA phone grips. Um, it doesn't have a hook keeper, so I had to buy a Fuji hook keeper right here. I'll have a, I'll have a little another clip where it gets more into detail and what the rod looks like close up close. And um, yeah, it's a, it's a two piece rod right here. It's ferruled right here, and it's going to be ferruled right here also because all majority of rods in Japan are are, um, are ferruled at the handle, so it actually comes off right here. I don't want to pull it off because have my real line connected still but which is a plus if you're like if you're traveling so you know kind of makes more space if you want to you know just get rid of the handle and you know you just have the rod pretty much a three-piece but it's a two-piece which is kind of cool i really think this is a a good rod for for two hundred dollars you know i bought this a while back for $160 online, so I got kind of lucky. The prices kind of spiked a little bit, but it's definitely worth it, you know? It's it, it's like a, uh, it's like the X-Pride, but it's like the lower model. So it has EVA foam, you know, maybe the same monocoque handle. It might be like different grip lengths, but other than that, it's, I think it's worth it. You know, you have your, I don't know if it's like a Spiral X, carbon like, uh, not carbon, like a Spiral X wrap right here, where it goes up, up, up to the blink. So I think it's a cool ride, man. It's definitely worth it if you're like into ultralight fishing. And it's really light. That's why I went for the 500 size reel. So, you know what I mean? Like, it's not going to be like crazy heavy, you know what I mean? feels feels like nothing you know so it's like you know very well balanced <laughs> yeah so as you can see I'm like balancing on my end it's pretty well balanced actually it's not like crazy heavy the the reel is only six ounces so that's really light and the rod weighs little to none probably like 100 grams or so around there, which is not bad at all. Yeah, so, yeah, it's, it's just, it's fun for like bluegill, um, even bass fishing, you know, I put six pound line on this, even though it's rated for two to five pound, it should be fine. But I, it's a blast. I, I would even, I would put four pound line even, you know, just to, just have some more fight in the rod, you know, having fun, you know, finding fish on a light rod. Because you can't really horse them around, so you're kind of just, you're playing with them, <laughs> which is really cool. Right here. Yeah, for 300 bucks, you know, $300 combo, this is not bad. Hey guys, so we're going to do a rod reel review. Um, right here, I have the uh, Shimano Sahara 500. I have this comboed up with the, uh, what is this? Right here, the Zodius 264 Ultralight with the solid tip. This is a two-piece rod, but this rod's from Japan, so it's feral, so it's actually a three-piece right here. Then it has no hook keeper, so I have a, a Fuji hook keeper right here. So you can see. Right there, it's the Fuji hook keeper. It's the rod. Let's get in this, the specs a little bit. Let's get in that. Awesome, so you see the lure weight, 1.5 to five grams, or in ounces converted, is 364th to 316th of an ounce. Two pound to five pound line. 
The length is 6 foot 4 inches. And the rod is made in China. But I think Shimano has their own factory. So, And I have this uh, comboed up with a... Right here is this Sahara. It's a 500 size reel. So this is going to be like my pan fishing, you know, bluegill. Like smaller game fish right here. So we have the 500. There's the Zodius. It's the Zodius logo. Right there. There. This is solid tip. So this part right here to right here is going to be a solid tip and the rest is going to be a tubular blink. So. One specs. Yeah, I definitely love this combo rod reel. It's great light setup. Shimano logo right there. Got the box. It's going to be a CI4 reel seat. Has this cool little red little accent right there. It's my Fuji. My little hook keeper, because it doesn't have a hook keeper. There. Cool, it's my ultralight setup right here. It's a combo Zodius. It's a 6'4 ultralight with the solid tip. It's a two piece, but you know, Japan uh, rods from Japan, it comes ferreled at this part at the handle. So it's ferreled right here, and it's ferreled right here. And I I never had any issues with it like coming off or sensitivity it's it's pretty on there feels like a one piece pretty much here we have the box it's a five six to one three uh three kilograms three kilos of drag or seven pound drag and it's a pretty light uh, reel too it's only six ounces you know, so it's not really bad for a sub uh, sub one hundred dollar um, reel. So it's definitely worth it. It's from Japan too. It's fourth wide, it's all in Japanese. So this is the uh, the five hundred um, Sahara FJ version. I believe you can get this in America also, which is like eighty bucks or like ninety dollars, which is not too bad. Sweet.